Lady Bay Festival. Welcome back. I'm here with your anchor Charlotte and co-anchor Martha. Uh, we hope you're having a fantastic festival. We hope you've enjoyed all the bands so far. This next project is actually a project I've been involved with uh, called The Phonons. And lockdown has given us an opportunity to work with our band, but also with a guest singer. So we would like to also welcome Simon, who has recorded all the way from Australia. So it's been fantastic to collaborate with him. Um, at this stage of the festival, we would ask that um, if you do have an opportunity to visit our Just Giving page, uh, we've set this up on purpose for the festival because um, in these testing times, we need to help the people that are helping us. Um, the NHS has a very dear place in our hearts here. And I think now more than ever, um, we rely on such a wonderful and essential service. So thank you very much. Um, enjoy the rest of the evening. We'll keep checking in as we go along. Um, girls, do you want to say goodbye? Goodbye. This one didn't want to be left out. No. No. We have a third co-anchor. What's your name? Nancy. That's right. Enjoy the gig, everyone. Six, seven, eight. Eight.
Lady Bay Festival. I hope you're all having a great time. Well done, Mike, for putting on an amazing show so far. And up next, the one and only, the amazing Subculture. Woo! I'm Ollie from the band Subculture. We're a free piece from Nottingham, East Midlands. We kind of base ourselves off of the 60s kind of rhythm and blues and soul music and from the late 70s punk and new wave era. What you're about to see are two videos. The first one's an acoustic version of uh, our recent single, uh, the B-side called Think Again. And the second video is a live video from a gig we did in January at a place called The Rescue Rooms in Nottingham. But before we start, I just want to let you know that this is all in aid of helping the frontline workers through this demanding time. So there's a donation page set up where you can donate any amount of money, big or small, you know, it still makes a difference. So yeah, enjoy. Push me around But you can't force my thoughts down See, I can dream and I can think And that's the way that it is But you try to condition me into what you believe And I'm told, think again I'm told, think again And take back what I said I'm reassured I'm wrong, but you know I'm looked down upon Cause power wants power and that's what it must maintain But I'm not the kind of fool to fall for Think again Disregarded cause it's not what I was taught And if I had the chance to get a wedding edgeways Still what a matter what I say I'm told to think again I'm told to think again And take back what I said
Okay, so next up on the Lady Bay virtual stage, could you please give a warm welcome to Eddie Farrow. Hi, I'm Eddie Farrow. I live in Lady Bay and I'm a huge fan of the Lady Bay Festival. I uh, studied music when I was younger and I've not performed for a long time. Um, so I thought I would contribute to the festival at home uh, to help out with the charity that Lady Bay Festival are supporting. Uh, please donate on their Just Giving page. You can find this on the uh, ladybayfestival.com website. I would also like to thank the frontline workers for all of their hard work. Thank you. This next song is a cover of Stent of a Pilot's Plush. And I feel the times are wish to go. Just 
This next song is called Dream Mother. It was written in the band I was in in the 90s, um, and it goes like this. Hey guys, it's Lloyd here from A Volcano. Hope you're doing well. Uh, on behalf of myself and Jay and Pete, the other guys in the band, we'd just like to say how gutted we are that um, the festival isn't going ahead this year. We had such a great time at Lady Bay last year. Really, really good vibes there. Really laid back atmosphere. And it's such a shame that it's not happening this year. I know it's it's 
much the same as everything else that's happening at the moment but um, hopefully something's um, organised in the not too distant future so we can all meet up and have a good time again. Uh, we never know how we're going to go down when we play with bands from other genres and bits and bobs but as soon as we start to see a few kind of Nirvana t-shirts in the crowd we thought right this might go down okay for us but yeah the crowd were really receptive to us the other bands were all fantastic and like I said it's just a great atmosphere so I really hope we get to play the festival again soon and to try and make up for things we've put a couple of tracks together in isolation uh, which our drummer Pete has painstakingly edited together and we've also got a couple of tracks from the Lady Bay Festival from last year, so I hope you enjoy them. Um, that's pretty much it from me. I hope you guys can all dig deep for the NHS charities and hopefully we can get some money together for a good cause as well. Take care, look after yourselves and hopefully we'll see you soon.
Hello, ready? Hello, Lady Bay. I hope you're all safe and well and enjoying the music. And the next act is the Smashkin Pumpkins. Yay! Dance from the Smashkin Pumpkins. A tribute to the Smashing Pumpkins. We're delighted to be asked to take part in this online festival. Lady Bay at home. We hope you're well. We hope you're staying safe. And we hope you're enjoying the festival and it's helping take your mind off uh, things a little bit during these crazy times we find ourselves in. Please take a moment to go to the Just Giving page that's being set up where you can donate to a fantastic charity, a local charity. Please donate what you can. It's all very much appreciated. As I said, enjoy the festival. We hope to see you soon at a real gig sometime. Take care, stay safe. See you later, bye.
caught that little child Inside of me such a part of you from the Lady Bay Open Gardens Committee just letting you know about our event this year which is going to be very different all going to be hosted online on our special Facebook group Lady Bay the virtual Lady Bay Open Gardens uh, dates for this year are 4th and 5th of July we've got lots and lots of gardens that are entering this year they've all been um, posting their photos and videos in the group so you can see the progress of their gardens um, through through the months and on the weekend itself, that's the 4th and 5th of July, they'll be submitting six photos and a video so that they can showcase the best bits of their garden. So uh, we hope to see you in the group. Um, if you search on um, Facebook uh, for the group itself, you can join and, and, and take a peek. Um, we look forward to seeing you there.
Hello, my name is Kasia Stewart and I'm the lady behind Out of Ink Studio. I'm a local artist based here in Nottingham and I create prints for interiors. All my prints are created by myself by hand using a multitude of mediums. All my prints can be bought in a variety of sizes and lots of different colour options. Lots of my artworks can be personalised, such as this one. You can add names and dates and personalised quotes to them. They make lovely gifts for anniversaries, weddings and birthdays. All my artworks can be bought from the Etsy website. Just type in Out of Ink Studio, all one word, and you'll find my shop. Please follow me on Instagram and Facebook. There you can see what I'm getting up to and just have a general nose about. Thanks for listening. Bye. The Nottingham NHS Heroes Appeal is our emergency appeal to help our staff here at Nottingham NHS Hospital. The appeal initially provided an emergency lifeline of food and other wellbeing packages for our frontline staff. Through the generosity of the people of Nottingham, we've been able to provide wellbeing centres, accommodation, rest areas and other packages of support for our team. Since the wellbeing centres were set up over five weeks ago, they have seen over 8,000 visitors. So we now have four sleep pods, two a city and two a QMC, and those are used for our staff to rest in and are being used night and day. Thank you to everyone who has fundraised or donated in support of our NHS Heroes Appeal. With your continued support, there is even more we can do to help the well-being of all our amazing NHS staff in Nottingham. <laughs>